You might have guessed thrift stores are seeing a big boom right now thanks to inflation. In fact, some resale experts say the average person saves close to $1,800 a year just by buying secondhand. As Michelle Lee reports, thrift stores are upping their game to get you to buy more and make ends meet. I love to shop secondhand. These are cute, but they're too big. What's old is new again. I'm a big thrifter. I've been thrifting for more than 10 years. Whether you're a pro like Joanna or you're a novice thrifter, there are some new things that are taking shape at thrift stores like the Salvation Army to get you to buy. My customers were able to get the best of two worlds. Yeah. Richard Vyer says you might not know that the Salvation Army is buying new items from big box stores like clothing and furniture and then selling them at a fraction of the cost. We put it all together, you know exactly what it's going to be like. The economy has kind of made thrift stores the new department store because here you can find things at a fraction of the cost, no matter what you're looking for. The secret here, you can learn an item's history by the tags. This is a $35 coat there and it's $21. That red tag attached to the original store tag means it was bought new by Salvation Army to be sold to you at a deep discount. So if it has this tag, then that means you yeah, bought it, that it's means, brand new. That's what identifies okay. it to our cashier. The rest of the tags are color coded and each week go on deep discount, which means each item cycles through the system in a matter of weeks. There's so many amazing things that you can purchase, but uh, really after five weeks, I mean, we've got to give it to somebody else and give them a shot. Let me go see over here, actually. Seasoned shoppers have their own strategies, but shop early and often tend to be a lasting tip. Even if I'm not looking for something in particular, I always like to look at everything because you may find a treasure. Another hot tip, some things that don't sell end up going to an auction at an even steeper price. Those auctions in St. Louis are on Tuesday and Thursday mornings. By the way, proceeds help with drug and alcohol rehabilitation services. Back to you.